Hey everybody, Brian here from uh, quantlabs.net. What you're looking at is my new iPad, the iPad uh, 3. Ooh, okay. What I'm going to show you is uh, a little app in here called uh, PyCube, this guy right here. So please forgive me on the uh, lack of quality of this uh, production in video recording. Uh, this is the easiest way I can do it. So essentially, I just uh, launched this app, the Pi Squared or Cube. It's called, uh, let me just do this again. Um, <clears throat> so it's called Pi Cube, this one right here, which is for, uh, you need to pay for, it's like uh, $6 or $15 or something like that. But let me just show you how this uh, app works. Um, basically, essentially, you uh, build your algorithm visually. So on the right, this one, the little question mark is your, I guess, answer, and this is your actual algorithm that you build, okay? So this is when you uh, have a new app, or sorry, a new equation that you're ready to build, or an algorithm. So let me just show you how uh, I do it. It's probably stupidly dumb, but uh, it's kind of effective. Um, so essentially, you uh, start off, and it's now asking for uh, whatever, and there's a little edit icon. So now with the uh, answer, whatever you want to call it, I can put uh, the content in. So let's say I'm going to call it, I don't know, Q, give it a subtitle of U. And in here I could uh, probably uh, give it uh, um, whatever my uh, description is. So that's the fields there. So there you go. I've got my Q uh, variable with a subscript of uh, U. Um, and on this side, this is where it gets interesting. Uh, at the bottom, you'll see a number of choices uh, for this particular um, uh, box. So this is what I'm working on right now. It's what the green means. So there's different uh, functionality I can play with. So in my case, I want to build uh, a simple uh, addition or a multiplication. So I try that, and there's different formats for it. So just panning to let you guys see all that. So in my case, let's say I want to do I don't know, a simple add breaks it up into two new operators. So there's a green and the blue. Uh, the green is always the one that you uh, work with um, as such. So let's say I'm going to break out a new uh, algorithm. So I'm going to do another uh, another uh, equation or uh, operand or whatever you call it, uh, a little fraction, let's say. Now I'm going to edit uh, this guy. Um, but you want to put a little variable in there, let's say. In my case, I'm going to call it... Uh, I don't know, um, uh, at the top here, uh, you know, you, you can use your Greek, so let me try that. So I'll put a, um, a delta, let's say. Okay, so that's delta, and then I'm going to put in, uh, I don't know, subscript X. And again, I showed you the description on how to do that. So there you go, there's your delta X <clears throat> with a subscript. Uh, my other one, let's say this guy, um, X. Uh, call, well, we'll call it, uh, I don't know, uh, just give me a second here, I always use this edit icon, um, I'll call it, uh, I don't know, we'll put a lambda in there, let's say, okay, um, this is a really cool app, oh, nope, that's a typo, my, my bad, uh, so, ah, takes a little bit of getting used to, uh, but once you uh, get used to it, it, you can whiz through the equation generation pretty fast. So there you go, there's a lambda. Um, as I said, you could put a little subscript in there. Uh, you could put uh, parentheses around um, things like that. You could uh, put an exponential to the power of, um, I'm just going under here, uh, to the power of, uh, I don't know, four, and that's it. <clears throat> so that's a very basic uh, algorithm. Um, I could put, uh, I don't know, I'm just going to put a, another simple variable in there. I'm just going to use the symbol pi here, um, and that's it. Uh, so that's basically the app itself. Um, very simple to use, very stupidly. Um, but this is where it gets interesting, is when you come under, I'm going to uh, file this or save it right here. Okay, uh, I'm going to email it to myself. Um, in my case, I'm just going to put uh, a text. Now, if you see in the content of the um, 
uh, email to myself, you'll see that there is a text version, which is right here, plain text. Delta, Lambda, all that stuff. Sorry, I can't zoom in on this camera. And then there's a latex version. Both of these will be presented on the um, equation part of the um, Quant Labs private site for members. So that's what they'll get. And then as I break it out, I'll uh, um, give a brief description on what that algorithm would mean. So uh, as it stands, it's probably pushing towards 100 algorithms and more and more will be added. And uh, these are, can be your algorithms, models, your uh, which lead into your strategies, which are obviously rules based uh, through uh, programming. Um, so that's basically how the algorithms are built visually, nice and easily, nice and fast. Uh, I could do quite a bit. Uh, this is the glue that has been missing in uh, for my algorithm development over the last few years. But with this app, this is really good, the Pi, uh, Pi Cubed uh, app for iPad. Uh, hopefully that will help you out and let you know what I'm up to.